platform creation yeah those platforms you guys uh, they can be tricky okay um, what you need to know is first of all they need to be drawn and uh, texture the proper angle uh, the proper isometric angle that you're using in your game that's number one and then they need to be cut in the proper way so if a character use that platform it doesn't look bad let me explain to you let's say this is your platform right here okay and uh, you have it's a bridge rope type of things just like in my game and you have those rope you know right here like that okay and you have after that you have a player that jumps into it if it's not cut if it's at one pictures it will be all behind it but it'll be also behind those the back row too okay so it will look right here it'll look awful okay so what you have to do or it will be in front of it and it'll look awful too you need to cut your platform in two pieces the back part and the front part if you have one okay what you need to do though that's very important is you need to give a little space that is in common for both if you cut it too sharp you're gonna create some empty space you'll see and you'll be able to see through okay so make sure you overlap it properly a little bit okay from back to front and you don't make a straight line okay uh, because straight line the brain sees it right away so make it wavy all right and then blur it a little bit I mean you know what I'm saying just kind of smooth it a little bit okay so it goes well together all right? and that's how you'll do your platform you need to cut them properly your platform and your bonuses and your props in week four needs to be put on the game uh, level editor all right everywhere like this like they said in your uh, actual uh, rough draft you guys okay this is week four and uh, this is pretty much it besides sprites now you're gonna need to animate those bonuses and those props so I'll see you in the sprites animation video